Many years before God's people were taken to Babylon, God promised the prophet Jeremiah that the exile would last 70 years. Then, God would bring his people back home. God always keeps his promises. Cyrus, king of Persia, had taken over Babylon. God gave Cyrus an idea. <gasps> Cyrus said, let all of God's people go back to Jerusalem so they can rebuild the Lord's temple. Give them gold and silver and animals. Give them gifts for God's temple. The exile was over. God's people were free to go back to their homes. God's people got ready and their neighbors gave them gifts. Silver, gold, and animals and other expensive things. Zerubbabel and the high priest led God's people back to Judah. They had been away for 70 years. Many of the people were born in Babylon. They had never seen the land God had given their parents and grandparents. In all, thousands of people went back to Judah. They settled in their hometowns and set up their houses. Then the people met together in Jerusalem to rebuild the Lord's temple. First, the priests rebuilt the altar in the same place it used to be. They followed all the laws of God for building. When the altar was finished, they offered burnt offerings to God. The people also obeyed the law about special celebrations. They had a festival like God had told them to do, and they made sacrifices to God. Then God's people gave money to stonecutters and carpenters who would work on God's temple. They paid people to bring cedar logs to Jerusalem. Mm. Finally, when everything was ready, the people started to work. They laid the foundation of the temple. The foundation was important. It would make the building strong. When the foundation was finished, the priests put on special clothes and the people praised God. They sang, the Lord is good. His faithful love will last forever. Then the people shouted and praised God. They were so happy. The foundation of the temple was complete. Not everyone was happy, though. Some of the older people remembered what the temple had looked like 70 years ago, before it had been destroyed. They cried. The noise of the crying and shouting was so loud that the people could be heard far away. Zerubbabel led God's people back to the temple to rebuild it. The temple was the place where God met with his people on earth. Jesus came to earth to rescue God's people. One day, Jesus will return to restore a greater home for all of God's people, and we will spend eternity with him.